Welcome on behalf of the Tonight Show in, in New York City. Welcome to, to everyone. everybody. We like having you here, pal. Uh, this is history here because it, uh, the Tonight Show has been in New York for, for years, but it's never had a sitting president here. So this is the first time a sitting president is, is sitting they, they, here. They, <laughs> uh, my advanced people didn't tell me that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I I'm not sure I would have done it. I mean, is there, <laughs> is there guess, a reason why other guys didn't do it? No. It, I, yeah, yeah. No. No. They haven't. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> The final, uh, this is the final eight months of your yeah. presidency. Are you getting a little sentimental? Are you getting a little weepy? No. <laughs> Come on. No. Come on. Yeah. no look, look, the, uh, this year's really busy. Just like last year was busy. I, I keep on thinking, all right, at a certain point, things are going to kind of ease up. And they haven't, and we've gotten a lot of stuff done. You know, I, I had a Cuba trip. I just came back from Vietnam, uh, Hiroshima. Uh, and so... The, the, the work keeps you occupied. Uh, every once in a while, you start thinking about uh, the people you've worked with. And, and that's where you start getting a little sentimental, but you try to fight it off because you don't want to be crying in the Oval Office. It's, it's, a, yeah. it, it, it's a downer, and then people would think, my God, you know. Uh, <laughs> could you know if if they leader. see the president crying, then <laughs> Every it, day. it could be uh, a problem. It's a, it could it's be a, a problem. It could lead so to a problem. So I try to yeah. screen it out. <laughs> <laughs> when is the last day? Like, when, is it, it, when do they say you got to have your bags packed and you got to get out of here? Uh, I don't know. I, I should find out. <laughs> um, no, that, it, 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 it's actually amazing because uh, they literally move all your stuff out in one day. You are living there, and then suddenly they, it's not all out on the south lawn. I mean, they pack it up, and, but they will move it uh, to wherever it is that you want to move it to. And, and uh, so you're, you're living in, in the White House up until uh, Inauguration Day, and in Inauguration Day, you're out of there. And I, I read on the Internet, I, don't know if, uh, I believe everything on the Internet, and uh, I read that <laughs> you guys are moving... Uh, you guys are moving like two miles away from the White House. You're we will staying be, in we, D.C. We will be staying in D.C. because uh, my younger daughter uh, will still be in school, and the idea of uh, her having to transfer schools, move to a new city halfway through high school uh, would not make me popular. I yeah. Know, I, know, I, suppose, yeah. <laughs> I thought you were going to be like that kid that graduated high school and just never left. He's like, hey, guys, how you doing? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I it, it is a little depressing if you kind of... <laughs> you're, you're like the old guy at the disco, right? Yeah. And that's like, <laughs> yeah. I'm still here. Having a yeah. kegger on the East Lawn, yeah. everybody. Yeah. It's like, yeah. all right, all right, all right. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you got to leave. Right. You right. have to go, sir. Yeah. Uh, People whispering. He's still here. <laughs> He's still... <laughs> what do we say to him? <laughs> Somebody talk to him. Uh,